we are going through a major, hopefully, hopeful change in the culture right now, which is people are finally identifying, exposing, and trying to solve the systemic obstacles against women directing. Mm -hmm. Women direct 4% of the time. If they go to hire uh, somebody for a job with no experience, 85% of the time they will hire a man. It was a first time director, so I don't have a lot of uh ego about my skill set. When I went into the movie, uh, I just said to everybody right away, look, I don't know what the f I'm doing. I've never done this before. Um, if there's something I'm doing wrong, please tell me. If there's a better way to do this, please tell me. One day, I hope that women that direct get to that point where you can come into the sense that I don't really know what I'm going to do. I need everyone's support. <laughs> never, ever, ever. We have to pretend, if we don't know, we have to pretend that we know everything because otherwise they will use that to annihilate yeah. us in that moment. We would never say that because the truth is, you know, as a woman, you have to work 10 times as hard. You have to be 10 times as prepared. That means you have to have rehearsed your actors, you have to have your shot list, you have to know your blocking, you have to know your lenses, you have to know your equipment because the truth is, the minute you say, I don't know, or you look like you don't know, it simply won't be greeted with a celebration because what happens is unconscious and conscious biases against women will come up and people will say, I thought women didn't know what they were doing. We are hitting this thing head on and we're going for gender parity. Mm -hmm. We want women to be working as much as they are represented in the population and that is 50%. Mm -hmm. Women are qualified, talented, capable and they should be hired.